Look at this thing. Brisket, onion rings, corn, lettuce, bacon. Are you kidding me? That's a win. Burger of the month for the win. We're here right near Cilantro and Chive, one of the most popular places in the city to fill your belly and have a bevy. My top two favorite things to do. Let's go check it out. In this crazy COVID world we're living in, remember, mask, QR code, ID, and you're ready to go. So excited. Buckle up, big dog's ready to eat. <laughs> I'll have one of everything. <laughs> Wonderful decor. Oh, I'm excited. Terrific, thank you. Holy smokes, look at all the options here. Oh man. Okay, so there's Canadian smash burger, Korean barbecue pork belly noodle bowl, braised beef ravioli. That was my nickname in high school. Ooh, the Lone Star Burger, the burger of the month. Oh, oh, but oh, the mac and cheese poutine with tater tots. Uh, Riley, can you tell me about the burger of the month? There's a, there's a charity component to that as well. Right? There is. That uh, started almost five years ago now. We, uh, I went and read a storybook to a kindergarten class, okay. and uh, kids got this little sheet of paper afterwards, and a top burger bun and a bottom burger bun, and they got to put whatever they want on okay. there. And we took a few of those ideas back, slammed them in a burger, and uh, it worked out. So we <laughs> went back to the kindergarten class and said we we're going to put it on our menu, and we we're going to donate two dollars for every burger sold to the uh, charity of their choice. And these kids raised funds for the food bank and collected non-perishable goods, and we're almost a hundred thousand dollars donated yeah. later in five years, and we're just having fun. Okay, so speaking with the burger of the month, I think I'm going to order it. Yeah. Okay, what is it this month? Uh, so this month we worked with Savannah Snow. So she's uh, a student at uh, Red Deer Polytechnic. And uh, the funds, $2 from every burger sold, are going back to the school there to help with the food bank for the right. Students Association. So we should definitely have a very Southwest-inspired burger this month. Well, I hope, I, I'm pretty sure I'll enjoy it. <laughs> I've got to turn down any burger in my lifetime. <laughs> oh, but then there's the dill pickle food. Hot wing poutine? Pulled pork sandwich. Uh, yeah. Roasted pork shoulder. There's the cabano. Beef brisket grilled cheese. Is that made by angels? Well, I mean, there's plenty of options, but I gotta go with the burger of the month because $2 from every burger goes to charity every month, so. And plus, it's toasted brioche bun, rubbed brisket. <laughs> hey, look, they got a wall full of memes. This is my favorite, look at this, 2020. Very bad, would not recommend. <laughs> oh, hello, beautiful. Can I oh, else no, I just leave us alone, please. Enjoy. <laughs> oh. Wondering if thousands of miles away, the sky is just as blue. It's as if I'm stuck in yesterday oh, when I'm thinking of you. Cause when you have your morning coffee, I'm turning out the lights so I could dream And when you oh, smile man, through good? the screen I Holy wish smoke. you could be I made the right choice So I lay my head to rest When the sun is rising I'll start a brand new day When the moon is shining Ladies and gentlemen, the next time you're in Red Deer, trust me, you're going to want to visit Cilantro and Jive. And for everything else food related in and around Red Deer, go to Tourism Red Deer's new website, visitreddeer.com. I am time traveling. I'm gonna need help getting out of this booth. <laughs>